find him. Lose the kid. And they haven't been able to find him. So he's dead. On a dare? Uh, on a, a dare. dare. Well, this th- 35-year-old guy, he was on the uh, Carnival Magic cruise ship right off uh, the east coast of Jacksonville on Monday. And it doesn't say, I mean, okay, so I'm, I mean, I'm reading this. He had to have jumped, right? Like, like, And you just went on a cruise, uh, Ryan. Real difficult to just fall overboard. Like, they make no, it's it, not. You, really? You I mean, there's no there's gu- there's guardrails to a point, but you have a bad slip and fall. I could I could see it happening. Oh come on now! I, oh like, easily. I, I've walked those before. I'm like, okay, you can't accidentally fall out of this boat. I mean, they, they, it's, you got to put some effort into it. You got to put some effort into it, to to. Uh, ju- it, 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 even if you slipped, you wouldn't go over a rail. You know what I'm saying? Well, you could get, jump off of it. But it would be a little extra effort. Like, yeah, I mean, yeah I mean, you got to want to be off that boat. If yeah. You, so, like, like this eighteen-year-old you're talking about, it was a a, a dare. The thirty-five-year-old, they're not saying how he went overboard, but I mean, it just kind of. I feel like you have to want to do it. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's been stories of people that have been super hammered and they fall off. Yeah. Have there? Yeah. I I, yeah. It, I mean, you have a drink package and limited drinks. I mean, you're not doing this. But the, the video of the guy jumping off the oh, boat. Oh, there's just video of it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. And the guy goes and just gone. Oh, I couldn't Is that a see, cruise? I couldn't see anything. But we're, we're well, he- it's, it's drunk people at one in the morning trying to film this. But, yeah, the man just jumps off. And uh, they said it was a dare, and then they sent out the, the Coast Guard to try to find him, never found him. Uh, so let me ask a question. The person that dared him, are they in any trouble? Like, I dare you to jump off this ship, and the guy does it. I mean, I'm sure there could be. Nah. Yeah, I mean, but they're in the Bahamas, I mean. Yeah, the problem is, too, if you jump off a boat, you're going to get sucked into the engines more likely than now, anything. is that true? Yes. It is true. Yeah, so uh, it's not, it's not going to end well for you. You're really not. So I should be able file to... that in my, uh, like, all the things that I'm learning about cruises. Yeah. If I happen to find myself overboard on a cruise get away from the boat as quickly as possible you're not going to make it if a cruise ship you, you 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 physically can't jump out far enough to where you wouldn't get uh in with the engines i've always heard that but i didn't don't know do was... that <laughs> hey, were there lights well, at the how bottom? do the people that have uh, survived make it then? Yeah. stops <laughs> oh, the st- cruise ship is moving like it depends I'll on how stop fast. yeah i gotcha okay. yeah so it's 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 not good it's never it's never really good for the most part there's versions of like if you jump with a raft you can probably do it but you're also that's the thing about a cruise ship man it's deceptively far away like if you're on yeah. like if you're on deck like 11 and you're looking down you're like that doesn't look that yeah, bad yeah yeah you, you realize you're you're 11 yeah. stories up <laughs> right <laughs> you know when you get to the dock you realize that yeah, yeah. Because yeah, when, you when you're on the, the dock, dock, you look up and you're like, "Damn, this is some big ass shit." <laughs> no, I forget where it was, but one of the destinations you go to, uh, maybe it's in Jamaica. I, I can't remember exactly, but uh, there are kids that will be there and they'll climb up the rope that the you know, and you pay them twenty bucks or whatever, and they'll jump off the ship. I forget where that was. Yeah, uh, Acapulco. Uh, no, some place <laughs> I've been before. Cliff divers, and, cliff divers, and, yeah. and maybe it was the Bahamas. I don't know. We'd sit and watch these kids like, man, they're gonna kill themselves. But you know, they get tipped out afterwards. I, I'm, I'm sure they probably stopped that but but um that was a thing yeah though you're right though it does look deceptively because like we had a balcony and i would look over and i wasn't ever really thinking of jumping i was like man if i had to i think i could kind of eh, and no. kind of go he's like no <laughs> so i just immediately go Shh. yeah there's a, you get sucked in the, the what's the undertow of it all it just brings you down into it. but how yeah. do the dolphins get to swim so close to some of these they're dolphins traveling at the same speed as the boat i, I want to see a scientist tell me this because I, yeah, I i'm trusting I, I, you i've heard what you're saying from a lot of different people but for some reason i don't believe it like i believe that you researched it you know saw MythBusters or something to prove that yeah if MythBusters told me i'd believe it show but, us uh, enhance ryan you're yeah. a tech guy <laughs> i don't i don't know I, i'm willing to believe though like just think about it like okay it's listen. moving fast I may have taken a lime from the bar, uh-huh. gone to the back of the boat, and chucked the lime and just to see. Top. Just to, and it just sat on top, and it just yep. it went, yeah. If you drop an ant from a high area, it's gonna it's it's, it's small like the gra- the level of gravity. It sucks. It's gonna float. Well, I threw I threw the lemon in the water, and then it it, it, did, it did not go. There was no under suck. So, and you fall close to a ship, you would most likely be sucked under the sea surface towards the ship. This is due to the ship creating low pressure as it moves. Hmm. A, a crew member. This is perfect. <laughs> this is absolutely perfect, and this is what they talked about in the um, documentary uh, about uh, the internet and go, uh, the social dilemma. No, Ryan, keep that up. Keep that up, right? Okay. Because I did exactly the same search that you just did, right? Mm-hmm. 
And what it says that for yours. On mine, it says if it's a big ship, you wouldn't be sucked under or shredded by the propellers, but you would probably be thrown away by the turbulent water around the ship's hull. Yes, yeah, so you'd be kicked what, out. So it's, but it, what, the, the, again, this is the interesting thing about Two Google. Different answers. But it's what did given, you ask? What did you ask? I said, what happens if you jump off a and what moving did you cruise ask? ship? I, I put in, if you fall overboard on a cruise ship, will, will it suck you under? See, it's a d- two different questions. Yeah, but it's, also, but in like, theory, it's the same. I mean, yeah. two different answers. But too. also the impact, like depending on how far, the impact of the water could just straight up kill you too. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. But the whole thing about sucking you under, I always wondered if that were real or not. Why it, do you say it that way? Yeah, yeah that's yeah, a weird the, way. The way that you said that. Yeah. Yeah. Sucking you under. Yeah. Yeah. Many that bad That sounds like cruises. the name of your next album. Where he redecided a marriage on a lot of cruises. Sucking you under. I can throw you <laughs> off this thing. Be <laughs> sucked right under. Now we went. I had a cruise ship employee tell me though, like, uh, like basically every day in the cruise ship world, somebody goes missing or commits suicide. Really? Yeah. Like every every single day. Uh, every, no. You mean in the in the in the entire world, not in every company. Not- yeah, yeah, and then in, in the cruise ship industry, somebody yeah. goes missing or uh, dies? dies. Yeah. Well, how, how many see- cruises are there in a day? Oh, man. That makes sense. Like, right if you went from a different country and you get in a port and you're like, you know what? I'm staying here. Yeah. You know? Like, you come to a, a, a lot of these countries where you're like, it's a real bad situation. You're like, no, I'm actually going to... Mexico's actually better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. When, yeah. We, when we were in uh, when we were in Cuba, man, I felt so bad because we were le- living in luxury on this cruise ship. And mm-hmm. then going in and the poor Cuban people that were there were, you know clamoring for like one egg yeah. uh, you know, they, it, it was when we were on the boat and we f- and we and the cuban raft we came across that was sad now that had to be no no that was sad as hell yeah yeah i showed you the video right no no no, no. yeah yeah you did of course yeah, i did the, yeah the, when the disney cruise picked up the the oh. cuban uh refugees did you think i was making another joke i thought you were making a joke right? yeah. i'm really sick guy was like this here comes oh, a joke because yeah, you know, yeah, straight into your comedy so i thought you were trying to say your family came over on a raft <laughs> no oh, okay. oh, oh wait whoa oh, yeah. i was waiting for the punch what on the it. hell Oh my he God. literally showed us the video of an, uh, his trip. And that he, wasn't he his family. That, yeah, <laughs> that yeah, wasn't was footage of you as a boy. I don't, I don't think I was. The, I wasn't here for that. Remember, I was out. No, I no, showed here. you. Yeah. and uh, it was a, fo- uh, yeah. a styrofoam boat that they made. And this, you, yeah, yeah, you were here. It was the beginning wrong. of the year when he got back from the cruise. Yeah. Okay, all right. Yes, sir, Angel. Um, if you had to guess, how many uh, operating cruise lines are there in the world? Operating cruise lines cruise or lines. boats? Uh, I, don't, I got two questions. There's two part of the first okay. one. How many cruise lines? Cruise lines. I'm going to say there are 297. 297 cruise lines. Yeah. Okay. Cruise lines, I'm going to say 30. 30? I'm going to say more. Cruise, we're thinking too big. I think cruise can also encompass smaller, so I'm going to go Yeah, tw- the small sort 12. of Tom Cruise. <laughs> 1200 mini cruises. Yeah. He's right cruise. on his back and he swims. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. There are 50 cruise lines um in wow. the world. Wow, How wrong. many ships <laughs> are in so those wrong. cruise lines? Now, if, you, if there's 50, oh, real 50. cruise ships. So uh, let's say like Probably a million, like uh, Wendy's workers. <laughs> 3,000. Uh, I'm going to go 150. No, no, I'm sorry. 1,000, 1,500. Like 1500? proper cruise proper ships. Proper cruise ships. That proper you're cruise like, ship. damn, that's a cruise ship. I'm going to say, uh, yeah, uh, 500. There's 270 licensed cruise ships. That's crazy. Wow. For 50 Th- cruise lines. That's all, huh? That's yeah. it. So no wonder it's... I mean, I, obviously it's a big deal to build a cruise ship because you're like, how the hell does this thing even float anywhere, right? Right. Yeah. But like Disney just made a big deal. They're like, they're building two ships, you know? And, and that mm-hmm. does kind of make sense when you think of like military too, how they would make a big deal when they had another ship because... Must be hard as hell to make. I ain't never. I don't know barbecue. I don't know ship making. And they keep making them. <laughs> they make them bigger with more. Now they're they're making them with roller coasters on them and all kinds of. I you know. know, dude. I'll tell you one thing that I noticed. Like uh, on this last, there's cruise. one with a water park. The water hell park. Yeah. The water park, they, and, they, and they got the slides like hanging off the side of the boat. Yeah, I, I went on it. I was a little bit worried about going on a cruise because I got I got uh, fat as hell pre uh, post COVID. Yep. You know, and I'm super and, fat. And I'm like, okay, well, I'm gonna take my shirt <laughs> off and be at the pool. And everybody on this cruise. 
Everybody, yeah, big fat fat o, super Every, fat people. Like, like it was crazy. Yeah. Like it was like a dad bod pool. Good. Yeah, yeah. It you, made me feel better. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's not a lot of good looking and shaped people on a cruise. No, it's no. mostly people like us that are a little there, bit portly. There was one guy, a little bit good looking. There's one guy who was in shape, and I was everybody's mad at him. Like he's like, get, get out, out, of, get out, get out of here, here. you don't belong here. Go on the I, upper deck. I, yeah. I saw that guy on my cruise. I thought he was a professional athlete. He's just some stockbroker. Yeah, <laughs> some rich stock, good looking rich. Stock yeah, all, looks all like the, a, the crew staff is all in super shape. Uh, they're all like, uh, and they're they all like, have to to keep yeah. it together because yeah. they're out at sea. I guess so. But like, I was just so surprised. I'm like, I'm looking at this pool. I just take a step back and I go, damn, everybody here is, is a mess. overweight. You know why? It's easy to be fat. <laughs> it is, yeah. Right. Food is good. And let's be honest, it's fun to be fat. It's way more fun to be fat. <laughs> That's fun. It's just like, I, I don't know when, it, like, I've always noticed people, but I think the transition in the last few years, people have just gotten Wait, fat. Are you health shaming? No, I'm not. Because, well, I'll tell you why. Because I went to Europe and then I could spot the Americans, like, from far away. Like, I'd be like, oh, oh there's a bigger dude. That dude. Here. I bet that dude speaks English. And I would sit there and I'd go, hey, man. They go, what's up, bro? And they can spot you, too. They, they, they... Yes! We have better foods in this country that make us bigger, faster, stronger. And fatter. <laughs> oh, is that and, how yeah, yeah, and fatter. That, no, that's bigger, faster, stronger, fatter. I mean, that's, uh, that's how the Europeans spot, like, with the trick that he was doing, that's how the Europeans do it all the time. You know yeah. what, man? I ain't bashing America, though. This Ryan Holmes leaves to Germany. It comes back bashing America. Yeah, being all uppity. Uppity. Guess what? Well, I like, I like I, my uh, vitamins in my meat. Yeah. Let's say he gained 20 pounds, too. Oh, uh, but, but, yet, but yet he's health <laughs> shaming everybody else. No, you guys I ever think about it like this? Like, like uh, I feel like this is the he follow. A, he's the okay. fattest on the show now. Yeah, he got him a lesbian haircut and got, he got fat. A, yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, dude, I, I like a bodyguarded face. I look at it like, are we ready to go to war? And I'm like, so I'm in Germany. I'm like, you know, the Germans throughout history, they're a little, they're a little ornery sometimes. And I'm like. I think of the German people. I look at them. They're all in shape, ready to go, climbing up mountains. And I think of our people, and I'm like, damn, we would get our ass handed to you, us right now. You know now. what I say to that? Man. $766 billion defense budget. Show me theirs. Not an offense budget. Get, yeah, guess what? <laughs> we got enough bombs to... We aren't running into Germany, okay? None of us are running, period. And We're okay? Uh, to your point, Ryan, though, apparently you did go on the Fatso cruise because everyone's texting in and saying that the all the hot people go on the Virgin cruises. Yeah, man, you're not allowed to because go Because apparently, uh, what I've been told, yeah. because I threw it out there, that that's mm -hmm. where I want to go to, uh, one of the decks at the on the Virgin uh, cruise... Is, is it uh, like a swinger party? Topless. Oh, T O P L E S S. Yeah, I'm there. I like it. That's the last time you've been. That is how I like my breast. Topless. Yeah, topless. T O P L E S. That is how I like my breast. Topless. And that's uh, no kids on that cruise, right? That's a. Yeah. Oh, they throw them off the boat and they test that theory. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you bring a kid on that boat, they're like, "Hey, who thinks here? Yeah. Sucked under or no sucked under? Sucked under? under? <laughs> no sucked under. Oh, do, we, do we have rides? Yeah, we do. Yeah, it's called the sucked under. You pay extra for that. You pay, yeah. Pay double for that, yeah. I'm going to go on that version because, you know, after my boxing body, after uh, I look like uh, a, a retired boxer, my mm -hmm. goal is to look like a retired boxer. Uh, okay. not, not, not a current not boxer. A, oh, my yeah. God. Oh, we 